Hello, you wonderful people out there. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are. Today, we will be doing a project. You know, I told you all, last uh, Saturday, uh, hubby and I went to a thrift store, and the, the jewelry that I made, I got those necklaces. And I saw these two wonderful chairs, they are beautiful chairs. And I want to take them and uh, do a project with them. So we went back yesterday and we picked up the chairs. They still had them at this little thrift store. So I'm glad they still had them because when I, I saw them, I knew I would be able to make a project out of them. And I was hoping they were there, would be there. But uh, I'm going to show you guys where, how they look. and. Um, they got beautiful designs in the back and all, so I really don't want to mess with the back. I mean, I don't want to cover the back. Usually I get a chair and I cover the back because it's so messed up, but these are beautiful chairs. So I'm going to do a project with them. Really, today I'm going to do a project with one. Say the other one for later because uh, you all see what I'm talking about. Um, so I hope y'all week has been going great. I know you all looking forward to, for the, to the weekend. You know, so, but I'm hoping y'all week has been going great. And so, um, we're going to get started. I'm going to get set up. Well, I'm going to show you guys the chairs. Then I'm going to get set up and I'm going to come back. And we're going to do a little painting and upholstery. Okay. So, let me show you guys these chairs. Okay. Okay, you guys, these are the chairs. See the detail on them? So, I got them five dollars each. Look at all that pretty design right there. Y'all see that? So we're gonna take these chairs. I'm gonna take these chairs and I'm gonna do something wonderful. Y'all see that? Look at the detail on the bottom of that chair. And this is the other one. The back was gone out of that, the pad of back, but it's okay. Because I will be doing a project with that one later on. And I want to show y'all the detail of the back of these chairs, which is really beautiful. Okay. Let me turn them around. Look, you guys. This is the back of it. Look at that detail. All down the back. So... Yeah, I'm gonna keep that. All right. So I just want y'all to see what uh, what we're gonna jump into today. Hook my air compressor up, my nail gun, stapler, a stapler, a poster stapler, and we're gonna uh, get started. All right. So let me get set up. And like I said, after I get set up, I'm gonna get back with you all and can you believe just five dollars that's what's so awesome about it five dollars I'll be back okay you guys I was checking out this chair the first thing I'm gonna do y'all see these uh, screws right here right here we got some screws in here. Let me get my glasses. Yeah, I can see them right there. So I'm gonna take these screws out. I don't, I don't think they really supposed to be in here like that. I think it's supposed to be something else. But what I'm gonna do? I screw them in because that one wasn't even in there. And what I do though, because this is a pretty design and stuff. These right here don't even have no screws in it, so they down here. And they barely is in there, so I'm gonna have to put some longer screws to go through this. And then, y'all see what I'm saying? Look at that. This screw. And what you have, what, what it is, that they wasn't even catching. And this is what I took off. Turn it around. This is what's missing. This is how I look. Have to take that off the back, which is insert right there. Y'all saw where I took it from. It would go on the front. But if I had another one, I want to do it back there. But I don't have one, so I'm just gonna put this in the front. I wanted to do the other one, 
when I do the other, what I'm gonna do is cut this pattern out. So when I do the other one, I build me one. And this right here been upholstered before, but it's really the same color. This is the old chair, you guys. Um, let me uh, turn it around, on around so you guys can see. You see what I did? I took that from here. That came from right there. And I think this fabric is keeping it, this fabric right here is keeping it from going on in, inserted in, in here. That's why I wasn't screwed in good with those, uh, with the screws they had, because they wasn't long enough. But uh, y'all get me? Well, we gonna, I'm gonna take this fabric off of this because it's really thick. It's too thick for it to be inserted in here. Yeah, it's too thick, so I'm gonna take that off. Let me lay it over here. And then, let's check out the bottom and see what it's all about. Okay? This is a heavy chair, you guys. Okay, let's see. Okay. The bottom has four. Can y'all see it? Four screws. Here, 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 and here. And these should be some long screws. Like that size for the uh, state. So let me move this over here. And then I'm going to screw the bottom off and I'll show you guys, okay? All right. So I'm going to unscrew this. Bottom. Lay it on this table. Mm. All right. So, the bottom just come off. So, what we're going to do is take the bottom out of this frame. Screws will drop on the floor, so I get them. Okay. I'll clean that up. Now, what I'm gonna do is go out here, I'm going to spray paint this chip. Spray, spray paint. So it'll be drying while I um, it'll be drying while I do the rest of it. So we got the gold leaf. Let's see what we got. Then we got the metallic gold. So I'm gonna put this, do these two colors together. Spray paint this chair, okay? And then I come back home and we're gonna do it with the bottoms. After why that's out there drying. You guys, here it is. I didn't want to bring my phone right here while I sprayed it because the wind is blowing a little and it might uh, mess my phone up. But uh, this is it. Came out good, that's that gold leaf. Put two coats on it. Might end up putting a third one. And we're gonna go ahead and take these cushions down. And then, look at the back, how it came out. Really pretty. You can really see that detail in those designs in it. So we're gonna go back in here and take, like I said, take these cushions down, take that cushion down, the bottom, and then we'll go from there, okay? All right. All right, back inside, and we're gonna take this, the bottom down, chair bottom. And this has a wealth card on it, which uh, when we're doing a poster, on a poster machine, you have the wealth card it's called West Card. This card in it is called West Card, okay? And my sister would have a, a big roll of it, and then we cover the fabric. It's, anybody with a poster machine, they would know what I'm talking about. But um, like I said, we're gonna get this West Card from around the bottom, because I don't think I'm gonna put no West Card around the bottom of this. I might do a cordon, because it might show the, uh, some of the chair, so I really don't want to, but if I have to, I buy me some rope to put around it, okay? So we're gonna do the, and see how they connected this? 
It's two pieces. And what they do when they came all the way around, they cut it so it could connect together, which we usually glue ours together, but they left theirs uh, not glued, y'all see? But we used to put a glue on in, on one of the ends and then merge it together. But attach it together. So I'll take this west card and all. And after that, this some good uh wood right here because uh, these staples is kind of hard to get off of here. But like I said, I'm gonna get I'm gonna take all the fabric off. And I'm gonna wrap this in some batting. This if the foam is not too bad. The foam may be too bad. Now, I only got so far, so what I'm gonna do, I am going to take this and see if I can roll it off of here. Hold on. If I can grab it. Usually you can take it and roll it off. Y'all see that? See what I'm doing? Look. You guys, I got this off. So next we're gonna be taking this right here, this fabric. And it look like it's only one on here. It's the, uh, and I'm sure it'll need some cushion because the way it's looking, I'm sure I'm gonna have to have some batting on it. So I'm gonna take this uh, off of here. We're gonna start. Like I said, it's some really uh, good wood. Real good wood. I'll be buying some more cushion to go on here. Put some more cushion on here. And it, like I said, if it's not really bad, we're gonna wrap it all. Oh, yeah, it's like it's all messed up. Look. I can see that's crumbing up under there. So it's no good at all. So I have to clean this, put another piece of cushion on it. Right here. A new piece of cushion. And wrap it in the batter. Gotta do. Girls gotta do what she gotta do. You all, I got it all unstapled. So we gonna see what kind of mess this is. Cause it is, it is a mess. What you do, you got to just lift this off. This cushion, see how? It? Look at that, y'all. Y'all see that? And I'm assuming they probably tried to wrap it or something. Oh, it's really old, you guys, because it's got the cotton instead of, uh, wow. This cotton instead of foam. That cotton on top of the foam. I'll show you guys. Look at you. Look at that. So then we got the foam glued down to it. They put cotton on top of this when they did it. So, you see that? That's what they did. So, and the reason they put, a lot of times you put cotton, if the foam got so dirty or whatever, and they put the cotton to keep the oil or uh, dirt or whatever from coming through it, okay? But I'm gonna cut me a new phone. I'm put me a new phone in here. So I won't need the cotton. I probably do a bad, but not the cotton. Okay? Can you guys y'all see this board? So I'm gonna have to completely clean all this off. Clean this whole board and make it smooth. Get all this stuff off of here. And then y'all see that? What they did was use a piece of spray. And they sprayed this foam down, which I'm gonna do when I get uh, my new piece. Use the adhesive spray and spray it down. That means it's gotta be clean so the foam can stick to this. 
All right, I'm finished taking that down. I'm gonna set that aside and we're gonna work on this little piece right here. So I got the two inch phone from uh, Hobby Lobby. So just when I got there, and this phone was uh, $11. Yeah, $12, $12 really. But anyway, got this. Then I got the battery. This is what I'm saying. I'm gonna wrap this in after I put it on the chair bottom. This is the battery. This is what you call it, okay? So I got one yard of it, which was seven, 99 but guess what it was on sale for uh 40 percent off so if you want to go to hobby lobby and get some of this it's 40 percent off now they run the sale so that's what i got and also i bought me some satin i'm gonna do that in satin the satin is satin fabric okay so i'm gonna get started i'm gonna get this cut to the size of the, my chair bottom and i'm gonna show you i'll get back on here and show you guys what i'm gonna do okay just hanging there. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna get, I got my marker, and I'm gonna trace around this, because I'm gonna cut it. And move it over a little more. So, we have two lines, but I know when my line's gonna stop. Oops. Trace around it, you know that line don't go. Push in, just trace around it, okay? Really, we need to stand it straight up. That'll give us a good cut. Okay? So, if I stand it straight up, straight up. And there we go. All right? So, I got the cut. I'm gonna clean this off, and I got the cut, and then we're gonna spray it and put it on the, the bottom. First of all, I gotta clean that bottom off, okay? So this is the cut, okay? So, let me go over here and get uh, one of my cutting blades, but, uh, and if you got a deep, uh, a real thick cushion, like a six inch or five inch, you can also use, um, carbon knife, electric carbon knife, okay? You guys, I got this cleaned off, and so I'm gonna spray some adhesive on here to just put the stick on. Make sure we lay it on there evenly. Okay. I'll just a little. Make sure it's on. Even on. So, slow it in. Wrapping. When we're wrapping this, the whole thing. Put it over here. Wait a minute, let me pull this back so y'all can see what I'm doing. Okay. Alright. So. Put it over there. And I think I'm going to double it. Okay. I hope I 
be outside what I was doing. Okay, you guys, I'm gonna be putting white satin on here, so I went on and did my covering on this. And so this is gonna be white satin, so I'm gonna have to really work with this real kitty. Get dirty, okay. And this is gonna be a little tedious, but it's gonna work. You gotta work. You know, I'm hoping it don't pull when I staple it, and hopefully, it won't. But anyway, try this, you gotta do it. All right, we'll get a station. One. And I'm gonna have to make sure. Two, okay. Let me put one more staple back here. Three. Let's see if I can do one more. This is the back. All right, now. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna rub all this to the front. And I'm gonna do my front. And it's gotta be tight enough, it can't be loose. So, like I said, it can't be loose. And it can't be too tight. So, put it so you guys can see it. See how I'm rubbing it? All those wrinkles are gonna have to go out on the side when I do the side of it. Right now, I'm gonna do the front station. Okay? I'm gonna rub this out. Rub out. Okay? And I'm gonna rub this out. Like I said, when I do the side, there can't be no pulls. Let's see what I'm doing. Okay, now, let's station the sides. Let's see what we got, look. Let's see there. Make sure it's tight enough. The other side. Up and out. Up and out. Let's put another one right here. Just want to pull it tight across the front when we do it. That'll be nice. Okay, so now we got to work on these corners. And the first thing we're going to do, we got to figure it out. What I am going to do, and then it's going to be a pleat, a fold. Okay, y'all see what I got? Let me show y'all, you guys. This is the way it's gonna look, okay? We're gonna put this fold and then we're gonna come straight up. Straight up, okay? Straight up. There we go. All right. Okay, now we're gonna go to the front. Fold straight up. K. 
Okay? This can go on under here because I'm gonna put a, a bottom, I'm gonna put something under here, okay? All right, you all, we going with our next corner, our next fold is here, okay? We put a staple right here, okay? Then we go to the front. Y'all see there? See what we got? Go to the front, fold it, really neat. Make sure you got a neat fold there. Okay. Then we're going to go to this side. Let's cut this stuff out of the way. All right. We're doing the corner to the back. We're doing the back curve, okay? Fold it. Take your hand in and fold it over. There we go. Okay? Let's pull that in. Um, build this in. This is our sides. Okay, we got our next corner we have to do. Let's cut this fabric out of the way. And a lot of this batting, some of the batting, if it's in the corner, if it's in the way, we cut it out the way, okay? This right here, it's too much. Let's put it out the way, okay? Now, let's go in here. We are going to bring this in, staple it, okay? Now we're going to fold this. See how neat it is, you guys? It's got to be neat. See where my finger at? It's got to be neat, laying flat. Okay. Now let's get this one, the back. Y'all see that, you guys? There we go. Okay. Now, let's continue to pull this in on the side. Rub it and pull it. And not too hard. Just, just make sure it's tight. You ain't got to put a lot of pressure on it. I'm pulling, but we got to make sure it's really nice and smooth and tight, okay? Now, let's put some, put some more of this out the way from the side since we got it stationed down, okay? Y'all see what I'm doing? All right. Now let's go to the back. Got to get this tighter than it was. All right, y'all see me rubbing? Okay. And I know the back is not gonna be showing, but you still don't want all them dips in there, okay? So we got to rub it, make sure it's coming up good. All right. All right, y'all see what we got? Side, front, let's get this side of this side right here, it's all this dip right there, y'all see that, let's get this right here, it's gotta be really even across there, y'all see that, There we go. We got this cushion did. This piece right here. So, I don't have to take all this off because I took the other part off. And this piece right here, we can put some batting over it. And we're gonna cover it, okay? So let me get this piece of batting I got. My spray. So I want it thick, so I'm going to double this batting.
neck. Turn this around this way. So y'all can see what I'm doing. We're gonna start at the top. Put a stape right here and station it. All right. Here we go. I put two. All right. Now cut the bottom off. Pull it. You don't want to staper it. Okay. Right now I'm stationing it. So. I'm doing right now. Two staples. Okay. Go back up here. And let me get this bottom. Okay, now I'm we'll gonna go up here. Y'all see what we got? Okay. I'm we'll gonna go up here. We're gonna get this side. One on this side. One on this side. Okay. Yeah. Back, okay. Guys, I got this done. We're gonna put it in the back of the chair. And we're gonna put the bottoms on and I'm gonna show you all what we got, okay? All right. Okay, you guys, I am through. And this came out beautiful. Y'all see what we got? Am I really nice? Y'all see there? This is how it came out. The detail. Little satin. It's really nice. Let me move this little purse out the way so you all can see. How it came out. Really great. And then we got the detail in the back of it. I'll show it to you guys. See how pretty the detail is in the back of that? Look at that. Came out really, really nice, you guys. Now I'm loving this. Really, I am. There we go. This out the way. Okay. There it is. Let's see if I can bag up so y'all can see it. There it is. Lovely. I love that detail. Love it. Love it. Okay. So I hope you all saw what I was doing, step by step, how I was doing it. I'm hoping that you all was able to see it as much as possible. And so, and this right here, it looks like it's a dip, but it's the light and the, the satin, okay? So, but if you like what you see, y'all please, subscribe to this my channel share this video tap that bell and let's get creative okay y'all stay out of trouble and love on someone love on someone and again I will see you with another DIY project my next one may be art I don't know but anyway y'all stay safe stay blessed you all have a blessed Friday, blessed weekend, okay? And again, thank you all so much. And there we go. There we go. Lovely. And I'm sure y'all saw how it looked before. Okay. Y'all be blessed.